What's up athletes? Welcome back. Today we have a nine minute Metcon. Metcon stands for metabolic conditioning. And what we're gonna do is we are going to cycle through three exercises, three times working for 50 seconds and resting for 10 seconds. All right, let's get through it. So very simple today, only nine minutes, but remember that you can add on a round or two to really lengthen that workout. All right, first exercise is a box jump. So you're going to jump on a box or any height that feels right for you today. You can also do a step up instead as a modification. We're gonna do that for 50 seconds and then rest for 10 seconds as we transition to our plank to push up. Remember for the plank to push up, we're starting in a high plank position. We're down on right, down on left, up right, up left. And then on the next rep, we alternate. So down left, down right, up left, up right. A modification for that is over here. Come back to your plank, um, your box jump position rather. And remember always to elevate your forearms so as to avoid going on your knees. And of course, our primary objective is to make sure our joints stay healthy over time. Last exercise in that little circuit is a sit up. I use an ab mat for lumbar support, but remember you have an option also to put a pillow or a little cushion behind your back. And we take the butterfly position to really make sure we focus on the core and lessen the help from the hip flexors. All right, athletes, simple today. Three exercises, working for 50 seconds, resting for 10 seconds, and starting with our box jump. Feel free at any time to modify. Let's do this in three, two, one, and up. All right, stand all the way up, take your time. You can jump back down or step down as I am doing here. And remember also, we have the option to Go ahead and do a step up. And if we're gonna do a step up, just alternate your feet like I just did. So one step with left, and then one step with right. Good work, athletes. All the way up, stand all the way up to get that full extension in the top position. Keep breathing. You got this. Good work, good work. Getting there, getting that heart rate up. You got it, all the way up. Remember, always just find a height that makes sense for you. Maybe one more rep today, and break. All right, losing my box here. All right, let's get it ready for our plank to push up in three, two, one, let's go. Take your time on this. Remember, you have the option as well to do this on an elevated surface. Good work. Job athletes. Let's go all the way down. Just remember to keep alternating. Extend all the way. You can try to go a little bit faster if you can. Don't break form. No hips up here or saggy hips. Just stay nice and tight. Now, sometimes I hear some feedback that you could get a rug burn on your elbows from this movement. And what I suggest to you is if you experience that, then please put something a little bit softer, like a towel or something, break under your elbows. All right, let's get ready for our sit-ups here in three, two, one, and up, all the way up. Do your best to try and extend on your Bottom position. Good work. Job athletes. Keep going. And exhale as you come up. Inhale as you go down. Open up and exhale all the way up. Nicely done. Good rhythm. Keep going. Almost down with our first round here. You got it, 10 seconds. Breathe all the way through, let's go, let's go. 
and break. Nice, all right. Let's go for round two. Remember, you have the option to step up. Three, two, one, and go. And I'm gonna do that. Sometimes with step up, I get a better workout because I can go faster and I get to work the legs in a different way. So both exercises are 100% acceptable and they both provide a lot of value. So don't feel bad if you're modifying for a step up. It's something I do often to really change up that movement for myself and also get a, a more of an intense leg workout. Remember also that it's a lot softer on the knees. It's definitely lower impact, but I still, you hear my breath, I'm out of breath. It's definitely cardio intensive. Three, two, one, now break. Good job. That felt easy. <laughs> All right, athletes, three, two, one, let's go. Four, round two, plank to push-ups. Let's go. All the way up. Keep alternating. You got it. Good work, good work. Nice, nice. Let's go. I am picking up some speed here as compared to the first round. I generally use that first round of any of these longer workouts to really find my pace. And I gauge where I'm at and then I can bring up the intensity if I want. All right, good job. Come on, let's go, 10 seconds. Let's go, let's go, push through. Three, two, one, now break. All right, let's get back into our sit-up position. Feet together, knees out. In three, two, one, and up. Let's go. Almost done with round two. Very excited that there's only one round left. Do you have a weighted vest at home? If you do, I would encourage you to give some of these workouts a try with your weighted vest on. And I will recommend to you also to get a vest that has adjustable weights. So you can remove weights, you can add weights. And what's great about that is you can always start with a particular weight. And then as you progress and as your fitness improves and your strength increases, you can always add on a little bit more weight. Three, two, one, and break. All right, athletes, last round here for today. And three, two, one, and up all the way up. I'm jumping on this last one, really making sure I just take my time, stand all the way up. Good job. You got this athletes. Almost done here. Twenty seconds. Let's go. So that's ten seconds. Try to get a few jumps done here. Three, two, one, and break. Nice. Good work. Gone through three rounds of box jumps and now Round three, plank to push up. Watch those elbows. Keep that hip low, in line with the rest of your body, and really focus on the obliques doing the work. So transition and rotate through the obliques. You got it. Nice, nice, come on, come on. Job, athletes. Let's go for 20 more seconds. That's it. Come on, come on. Five seconds. Don't break. You're with me. Let's go. Three, two, 
one, now rest. All right, amazing work. Let's sit up here. Last round of sit up in three, two, one. Come on, all the way up. You got this. Good work, athletes. Come on. All the way up. Good job, come on. Let's go, maybe we can pick up some speed here. Last little bit. Come on, come on. Five seconds. Three, two, one, and break. Nicely done, athletes. If you still have it in you, keep going, get back to those box jumps and try and add on a round or two more. Otherwise, great job for showing up for you today. And remember, it is entirely up to you just how intense you want these workouts to be. So when you see nine minutes, try to push and sprint as hard as you can for those nine minutes to really make the most out of that time. And of course, you're always welcome to add on a couple more rounds and check out the links that I have for you to complete a bigger workout for yourself today. Remember always to comment, let me know how this is going for you. Like and subscribe so that you never miss a workout together. All right, athletes, fuel up and meet me in your next workout.